only on nine this week's People in Places takes us to Hyde County. It's the second least populous county in North Carolina, but that doesn't mean there's a shortage of amazing places to visit, especially if you love the outdoors. Hyde County is really a beautiful place. And that's especially true here along the Pamlico Sound. It's just peaceful. This is beautiful out here. Here is the Bell Island Pier at the Swan Quarter National Wildlife Refuge, a place so beautiful you might not even realize what you're missing when you drive down US 264. I would say it's a very hidden gem and uh, a lot of folks in the county know about it, but not a whole lot of people inland really are aware how beautiful this place is. First built in the 1930s, hurricanes twice destroyed the pier. Today, it juts out some 1,100 feet into Rose Bay. It is one of the few public access locations for folks to come out and fish or do bird observ observation or photography uh, in Hyde County. But it's the amazing fishing that brings most people here, people like Deborah Black. A bad day of fishing is better than a good day at work. So true. Even when the weather isn't great, it's still relaxing. Lowers the blood pressure. Deborah lives in Virginia but visits Hyde County a few times a year and a walk down the Bell Island Pier is always a must. You get a smorgasbord of different types of fish, crabs, and it's just peaceful. Well, peaceful when there's not a camera crew in your face as you try to fish. Speckled trout, flounder, puppy drum, black bass, just a few of the species of fish reeled in on the pier. But if casting a line isn't quite your style, that's okay. There's something for everyone at the refuge, including on the long drive down a dirt road to get here. It's about two miles going through a salt marsh, and you can see a lot of different kinds of wildlife um, along that road. Otters, amphibians, reptiles, snakes, turtles, uh, a lot of different kinds of birds in that salt marsh. So it's a, and it's actually quite peaceful drive. Sometimes folks come down here and park and either walk or jog as well. But it's what's at the end of the road that keeps folks coming back year after year. If you love the outdoors, then you'll love the Bell Island Pier. It doesn't get no better. <laughs> it really doesn't. It's good fishing. It's clean. I just love it. The Bell Island Pier and the entire Swan Quarter National Wildlife Refuge open dawn to dusk every day of the week. For more information, head over to our website at WNCT.com. If you have a unique person or place you think we should feature, we'd love to hear from you. Send me an email to kwatling at WNCT.com or connect with me on my Twitter or Facebook accounts.